Hello right, guys, welcome back to the channel. Well, it looks like I've done it again. Um, someone down in Adelaide where I bought some paint from gave me a tip. There was a hornet in someone's yard. Me and Nadie went looking for it yesterday and she spotted it. So went up there and struck a deal with the owner. Nice old fella, uh, Linden, Linton, Linden, or something his name was. Nice guy. So here it is, here's another one. But as you can see, She's a, you reckon someone's pushed him into a barrier, so down this side, all the doors are buggered and that, so I'll have to get some new doors. Probably, probably, probably this bit of crease here. It looks worse than what it is, I think. Um, but yeah, plenty of spare parts, if I want to wreck it. Great bumper bar. But this one's different to mine, the other blue one. Across here I've got like a plastic cover thing. But this is a 73, and that's when they had to have yellow indicators on them. When mine didn't have to have them, mine should just got white indicators. Like the interior is really not too bad at all. So I'm thinking about swapping this interior over to the blue one. Um, it would be a bloody nice car in this day. Um, yeah, so there's lots of bits I can wrap to put on the blue one. I don't know what that is. Dead sheep. Um, they even got old white pages there, which you don't see them anymore either. But the actual seats are not too bad. So, and this is different. This one's a 4.2, so I'm gathering this to the uh, 258 or something they call it, which I've got those number plates SST 258. So, yeah, I'm going to try and get the bonnet open. Um, yeah. It's not too bad. Bit of rust in the front there. These little tongue, tongues are rusted, but they're not a structural part of the car, so I think I'll just rust convert them. So anyone knows, I'll be looking for a bonnet. Um, yeah, I've got the guards. All the guards and stuff in the back of the ute. So that's good. Hope I've other little parts. Let's have a look. Beautiful day up here today. Yeah, you got the guards in, actually, not too bad in it. So, yeah, this might be just either a put together basher or, or something. But, yeah, certainly goes with the channel, any rusting piece. Which we're not going to let it rust in peace. I'm going to clean her up a bit. But, yeah, missing that bottom trim there. This is your trim that goes across here. Uh, it's missing. No, oh no, it's, the rest of it's not really in bad nick. Mine's rusted out down the bottom of those guards. Um, this was had a bit of hard life in some places. Yeah, that's what mine's rust on the left hand side too. The problem is it's got gas. So I'll probably take the gas out and get it back on fuel. Just leave that cap there rather than stuff arsing around trying to fill up the hole. But, I think this front door is buggered. It's got a really bad crease there. Um, this back one, I think, is salvageable. It's actually not too bad. So this might give me some practice. Practice with some panel beating and stuff anyway. Um, yeah. Another cool old bus, man. And they're still out there, obviously. I didn't think I'd have much chance of finding anything. I'm just going to have a little bit of dash. My dash is all cracked on the blue one. So anything I'll take off or swap out with the blue one, I'll swap it over with this one. Oh, that's a different sort of dash altogether, isn't it? I don't know what's going on with that. It must be the clock or something. Isn't it? It's falling out from behind. That looks like much the same dash, so it actually looks in better nick than mine. Old school CD player in there. I've got a cigarette lighter. Natty spotted this morning. <coughs> it's got an ashtray here. I don't know it hasn't. It's pretty funny seeing this old school stuff. This one's still even got cigarette butts in it. <laughs> it's pretty funny, I reckon. But yeah, that's the new thing. I was going to try and change all the door cards, but they're completely different to mine. Mine are, mine's painted up here, and then the trim starts from there down. 
So these are completely different, so I'm not going to be able to do that. But I'm going to change the seats over. I might see if I can get them coloured or something. Should be able to get them dyed or, or coloured black. I've been still working on the yard. It's looking a bit better. Move the van up there. Just have to move it over now. Um, yeah. God, they're a good looking car though. Even if it's a piece of shit, it still looks bloody good, I reckon. I wonder if my, uh, my guards are a bit, more, a bit more flared than that. But, still, bloody good machines. Anyway guys, stay tuned.